Hello, Arcs. This is Mad Dog with another video. And as you can see, PSO2 website has been updated a lot. So here you can actually see and get a lot more detail and news about what's happening on PSO2. So no longer will you have to really rely on Twitter, even though you should still go over there for uh, more news and info about Fantasy Star Online too. So um, on the front page here, you can see you can play and log in. Of course, if you hit the play button, it'll take you to the site where you can actually, you know, it'll tell you step by step where you go to install. Um, of course, it'll be after the beta is over. We don't have to usually use Insider app anymore. Um, but, of course, it gives you news, races, settings, and stuff. Pretty much everything that was on the website before is going to show you on here. And, of course, you have more tabs. You have the news tab. You have your support tab, stuff like that. So I'm going to dive into this news tab real quick just to give you a real quick once over about what they've added. So in the news tab, they'll pretty much go over what you need to know about the closed beta. But I'm pretty sure if you checked out Xbox Wire, you've known everything that they've included in there. Uh, they talk about the concert schedule, how you get your rewards and stuff like that. So if you have the time, um, just come up in here and just take a look because there's a lot to be seen on this website and there's a lot to be told. So if you guys do have questions um, that the website didn't answer, you can leave down in the comments below because I do know a thing or two about this game been playing for about three and a half years to four years so if you have any questions concerns or comments um just leave them down there or if you want to message me on xbox live gamer tag is mad dog Ryzen. i will leave it down below and i will be streaming this later this afternoon as well too so i'm gonna also leave again my mixer down below so throw me a follow and if you're not playing um watch and enjoy so on here i'm pretty much guessing that they're going to talk about more of the updates to the game after the close beta is done so in the server updates they'll leave it there probably like maintenance times and stuff if they're going to do it like japanese it'll probably be every tuesday and early in the morning or late at night or something like that just tell you about the urgent quest and stuff which like i said you pretty much got the gist of it now the block section is actually really important to a lot of people who just now getting into PSO2 who didn't play the Japanese version like I did or were just very new to PSO2 blog posting is really good they do have their forum section up so you can always click on the forums and people will leave you know questions about the community and stuff like that so if you have more questions just go on and leave them there as well too um, they do talk about stuff like alliances or you know teams they're called alliances stuff like that um, also they do answer some questions that people have been asking a lot. Um, one of them is, does the game support mouse and keyboard? Answer is yes. Um, the game does not have AC for the closed beta. They might have it for the open beta because the open beta might be way longer, maybe like a couple of weeks or so, versus just the two days we have with the closed beta. And AC won't be used for you know anything game breaking weapons units stuff like that. It's mainly used for cosmetics, clothing. Um, you do need AC to buy mags, so keep an eye on that. Uh, AC is also used to purchase skill trees. So if you want to add skill trees to like your forest to do more elements, you could you have to buy that. Um, like I said, mags, affix bonus and boosters, and other stuff like that that'll help, you know, improve your weapons, improve your armor, and stuff like that. So, just improvements, you can earn this stuff in-game, except for mags. So, like, the ability boosters, stuff like that, people think you can only buy that in AC. Uh, it's easier, but you can earn them in-game. They do have fun shops, and they do have recycle shops where you can buy that stuff. So, I will make a video probably after the closed beta because I won't have time to try to do that stuff in the closed beta. I'm going to be enjoying as much as I can about that. So that's about it for this video for, the, you know, just basic information I can give you. Like I say, you have more questions, my gamer tag, my mixer, I will leave them down below. I will answer questions on mixer when they come up. So if you're watching and you can't play the game, um, ask questions. I will answer as best as I can while they're throwing up. But like I said, um, I hope you guys enjoy. It's finally happening. And man, it's been eight years. It's too long. But anyway, 
Hope you guys enjoy the beta. Um, if you do want to play with me, like I said, gamer tags down below. I'm already playing with the group, but I will be, be making an alliance. And if you'd like an invite to that, I made a Discord as well. I'll link that later on. But anyway, guys, four and a half more hours for the beta. Hope you guys have fun. See you next time. Peace.